for tomorrow's new COVID rules as well. And News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti is live in Santa Maria to show us what they're doing tonight. Patricia. Well, in less than 12 hours, businesses here in Santa Maria will no longer require masks. This has customers feeling thrilled. Oh my goodness, that's amazing. I can't wait. Bertha Steers at Me and Ed's Pizzeria is excited for the mask mandate to be lifted Wednesday. Especially for my customers and my employees. They hate it. It's hard to work with them on. Oh my gosh. Especially for Hector Del Rio, who works in the kitchen with a health condition. Very frustrating. Uh, I personally have asthma, so it's, yeah. <laughs> Starting Wednesday, Central Coast Health Departments will lift its indoor mask mandate. Customers at Anthony's Jewelers in Santa Maria say wearing a mask is nothing short of easy. I, I get extremely frustrated every time uh, I am told that I have to go into a business establishment to wear the mask. And uh, uh, I do it reluctantly, but I do it out of orders, actually. But starting tomorrow, me and Ed's and Anthony's Jewelers will be lifting the mask mandate for staff and customers. I'm for that. I'm sick and tired of masks. It's been very frustrating. Um, I have a hard time breathing with the mask on. So glad that this is coming about because it, it's very hard. And I know I'm not the only person because I talk to a lot of my customers and they all say the same thing. When you're like hustling, you're busy, you're running around and it comes down, especially with the glasses, they get all foggy. Oh my God, it's not a good thing, but thank God. Masks are still required indoors for those unvaccinated. For now, live in Santa Maria, I'm News Channel reporter Patricia Martellati. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Patricia.